lastly, the idea that truth does not need to be defended. You know, that, that it just exists on its own without us. You know, it, we, we don't matter. We don't need to say this to people. The truth just stands on its own. Don't even open your mouth if someone rejects it. Well, you know, they say it stands on its own, so never confront anybody else on their bullshit. You know, this is part of that no co no confrontation thing. So nobody feels uncomfortable. We could all just be all happy go lucky. So never confront anybody else on their bullshit. That's bullshit in and of itself. Okay? That which can be destroyed by truth should be. We are the vehicles by which truth operates in the world. We're that light. So let's make this a bullshit-free zone and we do not apologize for any inconvenience or discomfort. The universe is spoken into existence by us. It is true that the truth can never be destroyed, but we can if and only if we refuse to be the defender of truth, to take up that mantle and to take up that sword and defend the sacred feminine with the sacred masculine. Never, ever give up. It's about will. Continuous will is what the sacred, the sacred masculine is all about. And that's what brings the sacred feminine forward. So rage against the dying of the light and be the spark of the divine in this world by speaking the truth to other people. That's how we'll get out of this cul-de-sac of religion and government and the New Age movement. A different reality can be spoken into existence by us if and only if we care enough to learn the truth and then develop the courage and the will to defend it at all costs and we'll shatter all of the illusions that hold us back. And we're creating a new world, a new, a true new world order of light and justice and freedom. A different reality can be spoken into existence by us if we care to learn that truth. And when we do that, ladies and gentlemen, and only when we do that, when we step into that sacred union, <laughs> then we will free our minds. And in doing so, we will break our chains. Thank you very much.